Hello there, and welcome to an important episode of the Stave Decay 2 covered series. I'm your host, Arky, and, well, we are going to skip the normal intro stuff, because this is not the normal coverage episode. And actually, this is the last entry to the series before we actually have Stave Decay 2 in our consoles. So this is kind of a bittersweet video, and a bittersweet time in the channel's life. We no longer will have that special fan speculative discussion or community learning experience that we have had for so long. We will now have the game, and from that, our conversations will evolve and won't come from a place of unknown factors, but will actually be driven by the very real experience of actually playing Stave Decay 2 and learning its intricacies firsthand. And that's a great thing, but also a sad thing, because what brought us together was the love and excitement for this game, and we will soon no longer have to speculate or nerd out together discussing the game's possibilities or learning new awesome information about it together. Now we will be able to discuss the game as fans who have actually played it, so that will add a new dynamic to our community and the discussions, but I sure am really gonna miss these times. So yes, we are saying goodbye to the old coverage, but with the release of Stave Decay 2, we will be ushering in the new coverage of Stave Decay 2. And as I said all the way back one year and five months ago, Go, we will cover State of Decay 2 up to and beyond its release. So yes, our old discussions will be missed, but our experienced future discussions I feel will be even more impactful to the future of this franchise and our community. So with all that, I want to say thank you for being a part of our family here on Arky Gamescast. The plan was to create a discussion and create a community built from excitement and love for something, and that is something we have managed to do despite the hateful few that come around these parts every so often. I have to say that this game changed my life, but to think about it, the game was just the topic. It was you guys who changed my life. It was the community that gave me more reason and purpose than pretty much anything else in my day-to-day -day experience on this earth. For many of you who are new and didn't witness the growth and change here on the channel probably are not following this too well, but the few thousand of you that have been here from episode number one all the way back to the beginning of 2017 have seen this channel grow, and not only the channel but the content we produce and me personally as a human and as a creator. I have met and talked to so many of you, even made content and hosted shows with many of you as well, and it all has been one hell of a ride. The start of it was just looking at concept art and speculating, or the time we were trying to predict what we would see at E3, or the depressing time having to get through the major delay that really put us all in a state of eagerness and anger all the way up to State of Decay 2 getting its first gameplay reveal, and then the breakdowns and learning everything about State of Decay 2, and also having new creators start up their own series and start discussing the game all the way up to today. We as a community have seen it all, and for the proud and true, I know you can look back and cheer, and finally say we are finally here. Hey, that rhymed. Anyway, soon we will be playing this title that did so much more than just give us a zombie game to play. It gave many of us a community to create friendships and create a deeper discussion. No matter the size of our community, the people that are a part of it have and will continue to be truly cared for and appreciated. And the discussions are always going to be worth having. And not only worth having, but are exciting and are never going to be predictable. We are the community. We are gamers. Some would say we're higher quality class entertainment seekers, <laughs> but, but I do want to thank you guys for sticking it through with me and being a part of the Gamescast community, but not only a part of our community, but also the Stave Decay community in general. And I hope you can stick around a bit longer because we are not stopping. Really, we have only just begun. And that's why I want to thank you. And I want you to remember in this life, there are few moments you have to sit back and reflect. And for the first time for me in my my life and also this channel's life, I can truly look at the community's motto and really understand that no one survives alone. So thank you for being a subscriber and a viewer and thank you to the long timers for becoming true friends. I know, I know, I sound like a broken record. You're probably saying, Arky, shut up, let me move on to my next YouTube video. <laughs> but yeah, stay tuned because we have our Project DK series in the works to create the ultimate Stave Decay 2 guide 
built by a massive community effort. Also, stay up to date with Gamescast Live as our gaming podcast will grow its new wings in the coming weeks, discussing and uncovering gaming's biggest topics and controversies. I hope you all enjoyed this past year and a half of coverage, and I can now finally say, I hope your beginning hours within State of Decay 2 are just as fantastic and meaningful as I know mine have, and I hope to see you all on Arky Gamescast in the future. And as always, I love you guys, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.